The first image of Secret of the Treaties is of a dancer with red ribbon draped around their neck and arms, with lengths of ribbon cascading down to the floor. This ribbon, and the dancer's interplay with it, is a key motif of the piece. There are five dancers featured in the film, and they all interact with this seemingly never-ending length of ribbon. Their movement is informed by this interaction as they bind themselves and, in the words of the creatives, explore the boundaries of entanglement by tugging and pulling at the ribbon. Their styles of movement switch from lyrical and flowing to jagged and dynamic, contemporary movement informed by cultural dance styles. The creatives describe some styles of dance featured in this film as being derived from whacking and crump. The dancers wear costumes in earthy tones. The first dancer we meet wears an ankle-length plum-coloured satin skirt and matching bodice, both with gold detailing, chunky gold necklace and round gold earrings. Their short dark hair is slicked back. The overall look is elegant and edgy and is reflected in the costumes of the other dancers. They wear a mixture of long flowing evening gowns or intricately embroidered tailored suits in warm earthy tones like cream, maroon, red and black with chunky jewellery or a delicate gold tiara dotted with pearls. Bold black makeup streaked across their eyes and bold lips painted in red or black. They all dance with bare feet. There are two main locations within the film. We start in a spacious but well-worn church anteroom with a concrete floor. The paint on the walls has worn away in places, exposing the stonework underneath. A series of plaques line the walls and directly above these are a series of stained glass windows. The second location is an expansive field of tall grass surrounded by tall oak trees. The piece switches between these two locations throughout the film. A dancer draped in red ribbon stands in the centre of a dilapidated room. As musicians play, the dancer starts to pull at the ribbon that's wrapped around them. With ribbon-wrapped arms stretched out to the side, the dancer stares intently at us as they gently sway to the music. The dancer keeps unravelling the ribbon wrapped around their neck, arching back as they slowly pull it away from their body. With one arm flexed out to the side, the dancer stretches a section of ribbon across their chest, intercut shots of the musicians playing and a dancer thrusting their arms forwards in a field. In the field, a ripple of movement travels along the dancer's arms and torso. The dancer inside the room slowly pushes a ribbon-wrapped hand backwards. More dancers are in the field. They violently pump and jerk their torsos as they thrust their arms and legs in the air. The dancers spin and frenetically throw their bodies around the field as the intensity of the movement builds. Suddenly, they stop. A dancer pants heavily as they stare off to one side. The screen fades to black. We fade in to reveal the trunk of a tall oak tree. We travel up the trunk to see branches full of verdant green leaves. Tall grasses gently swaying in the breeze. A group of four dancers are in the centre of the dilapidated room, tangled together in the red ribbon. Using different levels, they are frozen in a tableau. Some reach up and out, others arch up to the sky. Gradually, they start to move, pulsating gently through their arms and undulating through their torsos. Despite moving as individuals, they each embody the same sensitive, slow and sustained movement style, making them appear as one being. With the ribbon still wrapped around their torsos and arms, they reach out with active fingers spread wide, grasping and twisting through the air. Their heads tilt back as they arch through their spines. A dancer stretches a length of ribbon in front of their face, their eyes darting from side to side. Staying in a tight formation, the dancers bend, arch and twist, their movements graceful and controlled. They entangle themselves even more. Weight of feet. 
the ribbon is pulled taut. Tightened between. With the ribbon wrapped around their wrists, hands and arms, they weave in and out of each other. Wrists and lips. Ruff of sleeves. They keep weaving. Curve of my... Shadows. They're now in a field. Palm of my hands. In unison, they roll their shoulders forwards, then sway their torsos. Bloodline flows, falls and crumbles like dirt. They spread out. For an afternoon high tea. They're dancing in different parts of the field. One dance that arches into a deep back bend. Our plants became yours to sip in posh china cups. A dancer spins with one bent knee in the air. Chromosomes of a phenotype. Fierce diagonal beauty is chaotic, warped and dangerous, shattering structures. Clawed hands twirl through the air. Silent. Choosing. Resonates pressure. A dancer kneels in long grass, an arm raised behind them. Thighs, lips, secrets. Lives of tribes. Treasures buried under time. Standing on the backs of the other dancers, one dancer sways their arms. Rich, delicious, home-baked, humble. They open a fist and petals fall to the grass below. We rarely hear nor meet the secrets that brought us here. Strips of red ribbon have been wrapped around tree branches. The ends of the ribbon dangle down. The red ribbon flutters and sways gently in the breeze. The screen fades to black. Created and conceived by House of Absolute. Commissioned by Sadler's Wealth Digital Stage and co-produced with the Philharmonia Orchestra as part of the Artist in Residence program. Director, Julia Cheng. Associate Director, Fionn Campbell Davis. Choreography, Fionn Campbell Davis, Jonadette Carpio, Julia Cheng, Saskia Horton, Faye Reader, Jerry Wan. Film director, Adrian Florin Ardelian. House of Absolute Philharmonia. Supported using public funding by Arts Council England. Sadler's Wells Digital Stage.